Hello everyone, and welcome, welcome, welcome. How are we all doing today? Hopefully everyone is well. Let me know in chat. So today we are going to be carrying on with the survival series. Yes, we died last time, so we're going to have to start a new save and crack on with everything. Dylan, what's going on? Hey, Samuel, what's going on? Games36, what's going on? Lars, what's going on? Welcome, welcome, welcome. As always, guys, let me know what the mic uh, volume is like and the music volume is like, and we can always fix that before we get started and cracking with the stream. All right, say what's going on, man. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Time to clean the ocean waste. Nah, we don't have any ocean waste at the moment. We have to start a new save. We don't have any. Yeah, everything was going so good in the last game, I know. Oh, it's fine, we have started a new save, that's going to be okay. We'll pick it up from there at the end of the day. Aaron, say what's going on, man. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Gabe, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Just, hey, what's going on, man? Uh, how do I get more power out of diesel engines? Uh, it depends how much load you have, but you should just use gearboxes facing the engines on a one to three ratio. Uh, yeah, we're actually gonna go uh, and get started. We're not gonna have permadeath enabled. Um, Rogue is most frustrating. It is indeed, James. It is indeed. But it's fun. <laughs> it's fun. Um, yeah, I'm thinking we'll probably have rogue mode disabled. Uh, June, please start. Yeah, we're gonna be starting very soon. I'm just catching up with all you guys. Hopefully everyone's been having a good weekend so far. <laughs> You're the only YouTuber that knows how to pronounce my name. Thank you very much. Um, Jacob, people are reposting my sub and putting a different colors on the outside. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, I don't really mind. I don't really mind too much on that sub. Anything else, I'd probably get upset, but I don't mind. The sub was there for learning purposes. Dion, what's going on? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, why didn't the add triangle one piece and updates? Uh, I'm not too sure. Um, there might be some more things coming uh, in future updates, but at the moment, that was just a little something uh, which I'm happy about. Um, so, yeah. For those of you that haven't heard, um, I put up the Seeking back on the workshop today uh, here in advanced mode. So if you guys want to go check that out, you're more than welcome to. Um, I know a lot of you have been asking about that. Okay, cool. So we're going to go ahead and jump into Stormworks here and then we'll get started with this. So we're back in the new new game actually um just over here we have set the difficulty to custom at the moment uh, obviously we're in career mode along with that we got first person only enabled advanced vehicles vehicle damage player damage npc damage shocks we cannot teleport any vehicles uh along with that we also can't fast travel i don't have permadeath uh enabled guys and that's just purposely because obviously bugs and so on and so forth um, yeah, it's it's just better if we don't have permadeath enabled. We also have limited fuel mode on. Uh, starting money is at 5,000 as always. We're going to do the starting base. Uh, and then none of the creator tools are enabled as always. Um, 
Yeah, Lars, we're not going to have the uh, permanent enabled. Uh, F34 Gamer, hey, what's going on? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Yeah, I know. They upload a couple of other things. I don't really mind as long as it's uh, as long as it's in the description where it says do not upload, um, then it's fine. Otherwise, I'll get the um, Steam the Steam community mods to take it down if I don't want it up there. Um, thank you very much for the uh, <coughs> kind words on the Sea King. Thanks, man. Uh, fuzzy buddy, hey, what's going on, man? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, you, Joel, what's going on, man? Welcome. Um, Yes, the Viet Cong boat will return today. Um, we'll see. Obviously, we can load that straight in uh, and hopefully get some missions done and start unlocking a couple components. So we're going to go ahead and load this up. And yeah, first thing I'll do is, uh, yeah, we'll spawn that boat and see if we can get it working. Uh, if we obviously need to make any changes because we don't have anything unlocked yet. Um, so yeah, <laughs> good luck. Thank you very much. Um, Nightbot, do you abuse? No, Nightbot's okay. He's, he keeps things in order here, guys. Nightbot keeps things in order. Uh, did I look at the wave hard boat thing? Uh, yeah, I did. Um, I think the problem is that you don't have the wheel touching. You don't have two wheels. You only have one. Um, that's. I think that's my personal opinion. That's why it's probably not working. And also, there's not enough surface area to catch the waves. Uh, that could also probably be another issue. Can you make a trips and tricks video? Uh, I got one for the uh, workbench. I got a tips and tricks video for the workbench. You can go check that out. Um, James, love your videos. Uh, I don't have to play with them. Great, thank you very much, man. That's why they're there. That's why they're there. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm pretty happy with this character, so we're just gonna go ahead and hit straight into it. Just gonna lower the volume a bit in game volume. And yeah, we're back on our creative base as always. Uh, let's have a look at the map and see what have we got close to us. Okay, so we got something where we can buy crude oil nice and close to us. Uh, and then I think everything else looks like it's quite far away. Seems to be another platform there. But I think, yeah, okay. Not too bad of a save or a seed at least. Uh, let's get on to here and see if we can load in our Vietnam slash... Navy speedboat, whatever it is, actually. Um, so let's go ahead and jump into this as soon as it loads. Come on, load now. If I'm correct, this do you see? I'm missing the electrical cables and the electric battery medium, so we'll have to fix that. Um, so that and that we can get rid of, and we'll just fix it by putting those blocks there. So it was electric cables that we we're missing, and something else oh battery um but it's fine we still have the small batteries which is fine those are connected in the right places let's just make sure we have electricity is all connected to everything it is remember this one is still the one with only two engines uh because i didn't save the one that we changed with six engines uh so this is costing us three thousand i think what we might do guys is before we actually get started with this i think we should probably just change this engine setup uh so we get a really nice fast boat to start with uh and then i actually i'm sorry i'm going to ignore the chat for a bit guys so we get we just get this all done and 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 sort of before we before we actually get going here um so i'm just going to go ahead and delete most of all the piping and the engines and we're going to rework rework all that uh as we did in the last actually in the last one and we'll get that all sorted and going and we'll redo all the logic. I don't know what that does at the moment. Uh, and we'll sort that out. Don't know what's happening with this. Oh, we'll fix all of that. Uh, okay, and then let's get rid of our fuel tanks and we'll just reposition the fuel tanks and we'll get rid of the exhaust also. Cool, uh, so that's done. We'll get rid of all of that. And then we'll place down our engines here. And then what was this? This was our... Okay, we'll get that turned and we'll get into the center. I think that's air, to be honest. Okay, and then we need straight pipes. Don't need 
need straight pipes. We just need a corner piece just over here. Like so. Okay, that's done. And just need that. And then fuel. We'll take fuel out of here at some stage. Bring it into there. Let's just figure out our gearbox situation at the rear. We'll have three gearboxes as we usually do. Get rid of that. Get another gearbox down. Fantastic. And then let's get some more gearboxes down. Cool. Got that done. I'll catch up with all these subs quickly. Hold on. Uh, MCPE, thank you very much for the sub, man. Nick, thank you very much for the sub. And Jacob, thank you very much for the sub, man. Welcome, 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 everyone. I just, you guys won't stop with the subs here, will you? Struck Arrow, thank you very much for the sub, man. Much appreciated, as always. Hey, Blob, what's going on? Welcome, welcome, welcome. No, don't ignore us. Barrel, no, I'm here. I'm going to be, I'll catch up with you guys as, as I can. Don't worry about that. Uh, okay, cool. So we've got the gearboxes done. Uh, well, let's go ahead and place down these engines quickly. Uh, ch -ch -ch. Where are they? I think we should have enough money to put the engines down, to be fair. Um, we'll see how we get on, actually. Exactly the same setup as we did in the last in the last video. Where we'll have six engines, because it was really... It was, it was more than fast enough, the six engines. So we got that. We'll get our fuel tanks in also, uh, while we're grabbing components and things. Let's grab our medium fuel tanks. And we should be able to fit quite a few of them in here. There we go. And we can get that all piped up. Go. Cool. Fuel tanks are done, uh, gearboxes are more or less done, we'll obviously need to change the ratios on those, but that's fine, that's easy enough to set up. Uh, we need to start thinking, this. what was this? This was about air, so we need to do the air, I'll just do those white for now. These blocks, oh actually we need to just double check exhaust, fuel, okay, so these engines need to actually go out for now, because they are the wrong way. So take that. Place them there and then invert them. And then that should be exhaust, exhaust, fuel, fuel, cool. And then exhaust, exhaust, great. Grab that. That there, and let's just double check that that's the same thing. Coolant out, coolant out, exhaust, exhaust. Okay, great. Uh, so let's just do our air intakes for all these engines. Which is easy enough to do actually. Um, here we'll do that, that, and then that, 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 and then I just need to come here and put that here. There we go, that's done. Uh, that's all the air for the engines all done and taken care of. Uh, next we obviously needed the fuel. Now fuel's there, so we can just literally go from there, grab one of these. Oh, hold on, no, wrong. That's the that's the fuel for transporting. We don't want any of that fuel. We want the fuel from here, uh, which we, hmm, I think we should take it underneath. So we'll go here, 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 and then come out and then we have uh yeah that's fine we'll get from there oh no we can't can we need it to come there and then there i think yeah i think that'll be fine okay so let's go ahead and do that now so we'll use our corner pipes just here okay chat um what's going on you love Croatia? Cool, man. Um, okay. Yeah, you guys seem to be all good there. 
is fine. Okay, so we're going to carry on doing this. Uh, we'll wire that to go there. This is going to make a turn here and then a, another turn there. And then from there, it's going to go up like that, I think. No, that's wrong. I think that's good yep it is cool okay so that's gonna be our fuel gonna go there 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 and I think I just need some straight pipes there I do yes done and done and we'll paint that all later on uh, and then let's get the fuel connected up here so we'll just go up here and turn it there okay so that's all the fuel coming through the pipes and then we just need to feed it up into the system so i think fuels there exhaust is there fuels there and fuels there perfect so we'll just do straight pop up corner piece corner piece and a t piece and that's fine we just need to alter this one because that is an exhaust so we don't want that Okay, so that's done for the fuel. Uh, the power is coming out the top of the engine, so that's actually quite easy to do. So over there and over there, and that will just come out and then we'll feed it into our different areas. Should be easy enough, I think, at the end of the day. Uh, cool. Uh, we actually might need to move these gearboxes back. Just one. go there we go and there we go and then that's going to come up and then go into the respective respectable engines cool the one two three perfect make sure grab our orange pipes here and show you guys what i'm talking about Okay, one, two, three, and then that's gonna come up into those of which we are going to use T pieces for here. Here and here, and then we'll use our angled pieces over there and over there, not there. That there and that there and then we need to do the same just here so done done and done cool uh, and then just straight pipes going along there cool Cool. and then green pipes there okay so that's all the power taken care of we've done the fuel we've done the power uh let's do the coolant for these engines uh it should be pretty straightforward and simple we're just gonna delete blocks uh, i'm just gonna enable my explain again quickly delete that delete that delete that and we are gonna go grab one of those and we are going to just put them down here simple direct ports cooling Nothing special. Into the water, out of the water. Nothing fancy. Uh, if you want, you, I guess we could even put on the other side too. It doesn't really matter that much. Um, so we can have lots of them. Oops, wrong way. Now we could just use popping to just bring it all. But um, eh, while, while we're here, we might as well just do all of them they all have their own ports so there's no restrictions and then we're just literally just doing that it's super simple and super i don't know what i did there but it should be pretty super ah oh, no cool uh and the last thing we need to do is the exhaust oh and we also need to do the fuel from the other sides oh i forgot about that uh delete that 
grab that, grab that. Come on. Doesn't want me to place that, there we go. Uh, and then I think we also need to do it for this side here. So we'll do that also. Great stuff. Okay, uh, so that's done. Uh, last thing we need to do is the exhaust. Uh, as I said earlier on, uh, the exhaust actually goes to the back here. Um, so we need to figure out like a, a easy, easier way or easy way to do it. Uh, I'm thinking, let's see, we need to try and get it to fit through here. The exhaust is on that side, the exhaust is on that side, and the other exhaust is over here. So what we possibly could do is get that exhaust to come maybe through here uh, i don't know hmm. i'm thinking probably the outside would probably be the easiest thing to do um but i'm trying to get it so we don't get it through any of these pipes or anything or get in the way of any of these pipes um oh we also need to add our generators in somewhere i'm not too sure where we're going to put them but uh maybe here just two small just two small generators coming out these engines just like so, and then let's grab the generator. Okay, so journeys are done, uh, and let's do, let's do the piping for the exhaust. And what I'm thinking is join them the two together here in the center, like so. Uh, actually, no, we won't. Keep them separate. Keep them separate and then we'll run them straight across until we can bring them down, which is just over here. And then we'll run them underneath the boats. I think would probably be the smartest thing to do. So go down here, go up. This one? Yes, it is. So what we'll do is we'll run it across just like so. And it needs to come Hmm. It needs to come to this is going to be quite a difficult challenge I think because in theory we need to get onto that wall um, actually no hold on hmm. I want to bring it here Okay, hold on. I've got a different idea. Uh, delete, 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 delete. There. And then we are going to bring it. We're going to delete that one piece there. And we're going to bring it out here. Uh, cool. That's why, that's that's how we're going to do it. Uh, it's not the prettiest of way, but I guess, I guess it's okay at the moment. Um, Nick, what's going on, man? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, Josie, when will the amphibian attack craft uh, thing be released? What do you mean? What do you mean? What what amphibious thing? Uh, are gearboxes worth it in survival? Oh yeah, definitely, definitely worth it. Gearboxes, hundred percent, definitely recommend using gearboxes. Um, okay, we need black here. So let's go. We need a corner angled piece. Right, so thank you very much for the sub, man. Much appreciated and welcome. Got that coming. Uh, it's going to come along into here and then it's going to go out here. Come on, turn. Is that facing the right way? No, it's not. Oh, man. Can't see. There we go. Cool. And then straight pipes all the way to the back where the exhaust is coming out. Um, or straight enclosed pipes, should I rather say. Cool. That's done. Um, we just need to actually bring it into here. So like that. And like that. And that's the exhaust there. We need to worry about the middle one. The other side's done. Uh, the middle one, pff, uh, honestly... I'm not 100% sure how I'm going to get that middle one across. Uh, be fair, but I'm thinking along the lines of 
probably bring it underneath the ship so out like this down and then attaching it like that and then bringing it there 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 and it's gonna stick out over there and then we'll have to bring it through there which is also gonna stick out but that's okay and then here we can use a T piece so let's go and do that and grab a T piece go another corner piece going down then straight pipe straight pipe and some more straight pipes and then we'll just need some corner piece i know it looks it looks terrible on, over there but that was the solution that i had at the moment uh if i can think of another one i'll probably change it at some point uh but it's okay at the moment i guess there and then we want this one to turn like that and then while we're here let's go ahead and paint all this go and paint all that stuff and then i guess we could even protect maybe do something that protects that uh, and that something like that Like that. Hmm, let's see. Something like that, I think. Probably be the key. Yeah, that's cool. And then that's that's nicely protected. What's going on there? Ah, oh, okay. That's fine. That's... Make sure that's done. Okay, cool. So it's got a little bit of a bulge on the side there, but that's fine. Uh, at the end of the day. Uh, yeah, facing yeah. Uh, which way do the arrows face the gearbox uh, to make the engine have more efficiency? Uh, face the engine. Usually, at one to three is really good. Um, And that works that works really well um you'll see now when we when we test this out i've i think we're done with all the stuff here uh we've got the air we've done all that we just need to change the ratios on the actual engines and then we also just need to do our logic um so the first one is going to come out at a one to three by default and the second ratio on that is going to be a minus one and then the second one is going to start off as a minus as a one to one. So and then it's going to turn into a one to three. So one to three to start one and then we can change it into reverse if we want to. So the boat can obviously go in reverse. And then the second one is going to be one to one standard because if we hit it in one to three to start with, it's going to kill the engine and it won't be able to turn over. Uh, so we have it as a one to three. So once we've built the RPS up, we can then exchange it into a higher into a higher rev, which will be great. Uh, so we get more power coming out. Fuel tanks are all on diesel, which are good. Uh, we are going to turn the engines up to a hundred RPS because we'll be running it at such low throttle. It's not really going to make a difference for us. So I'm just going to go ahead and change all these to hundred RPS. Now, before we continue any further, uh, I'm going to go ahead and just save this. So I don't want to lose it. Uh, and then we need to start thinking about logic. Now, there's a couple things actually that we I need to add to the ship uh, or to the little boat before we actually carry on any further. So it's some more small detailing things. Uh, I'm just going to do some lights. So let's grab those. Place those there. Uh, and then we're going to paint them. So now if I'm correct from what we said last time was red was on the left. Uh, and green is on the right uh, so we'll leave those like that uh, correct me if I'm wrong obviously as always guys uh, but I think I am right on saying that 
We're gonna obviously connect all our battery uh, things to everything we need to. So obviously all our engines and all of our gearboxes. So we'll get that all connected up. Oh, last one was already connected apparently. So we'll get that connected. Uh, the next thing we need to do is double check our logic. Now, this was for lights. So we'll go ahead and turn those on. Cool. And let's see what's going on in here. Now, temperature, RPS. So we need to take the six engines and do some logic for that. Uh, we also have our fuel, which once again, we'll need to do some logic to add all those fuel tanks up together. Um, yeah, we'll do some logic to add those all together. Uh, throttles already hooked up. Uh, our batteries already hooked up. Our other batteries already hooked up. All that's pretty much hooked up. Uh, the only thing we need to actually connect up now is just our, our logic to actually work out our fuel and also our RPS and temp. Now, you guys know I've done some um, microcontrollers for that. So we'll go ahead and open up the microcontroller bits. I think, let's see. Um, two, I have a two to one engine stats. I don't have a six, I have a 61% fuel, so we can use that. So go and grab that and we'll just make it red. Where is my 61 fuel? Uh, 61 engine display. Oh, actually, yeah, I think that's from last time. We'll use that one uh, if we can find some space for it, of course. Uh, we'll place that. Uh, let's place it in the front or even in here, rather. I'll be fine. Big block, though. Jesus. Okay, and then we also needed our tank percentages so we'll grab that logic also uh and then we'll start adding those together now you guys have seen in the last series how we built these it's pretty simple um so for the fuel it's just, really just taking all of these adding them all together and then dividing them by six uh so pretty simple like oh this is actually we have eight tanks so we'll need to modify that so hold on let me just uh, go into this we need to add two more into this so i'm just going to go ahead and add one two and that's going to be input seven inputs eight and we're going to change that to number and number cool and we'll go to the logic part and you'll see here is our extra logic that came through so we just need to add that together okay added 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 and then we need to add it like that add that to that and then bring that up there and that's getting divided by 116 so we need to work out we need to work out that um to get the percentage so 116 divided by six let's see 116 divided by six equals 19. how many liters in each how many liters are in each small one Oh, sorry, each medium medium tank, guys. Let me know, I can't remember. Uh, Mr. did you, uh, that boat have an autopilot? No, uh, this boat doesn't have an autopilot. We haven't done the logic. We, I, I guess we could do the logic, to be fair, because we have microcontrollers enabled. We could probably do that. Um, I guess we could. You know, hey, what's going on? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, 185. 185 liters per per tank um, 187.5 okay so what are we doing we're taking all of those adding them up together uh so 187.5 times by eight equals 1500 1500 and then we're timesing about 100 cool okay so let's save that as our fuel percentage cool and then let's go and grab that's cool and let's do the logic for that now okay that's pretty sure pretty simple one two three four one two three and four and then it comes out of percentage sweet all simple and easy and done uh now the next thing is the engines first off obviously i can't remember what we had i think one was our hotkey for the engines to turn on and off yeah it was so we'll go ahead and connect that so one off to all our engines 
We also have our gear for. Let's see what on our, what's happening on the seat. Uh, two was gear, and then what was six? High gear. So two was the reverse gear, which is the first one. If I'm correct, so let's double check that. So, so get rid of that. Get, turn that, that, and that. So that was to change in reverse gear, and then I think six was to change it into high gear. That's fine. That's done. Uh, and then we need a throttle, which was coming from WS, if I'm correct. Yes, it was. We'll hit the throttle into our engines. Great. That's done. What else? Um, oh, we can all, can we limit the throttle? We can't limit that. Okay, no worries. Uh, that's fine. Got that done. We need to then connect all our RPSs and things together. So temperature. You can see RPS temp one. This temp. That's rotations. That's temp. Temp two. Temp three. Temp four. M5 and M6, cool. And then we need the RPS, so that's one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, cool. And then we have the outputs, which is RPS output going up there and temp output going, cool. Electricity, what are we missing? I think we did everything, didn't we? Yeah, we did. Uh, oh, generate uh, generators. Ooh, almost didn't connect those. Um, hold on, that's the emergency battery, which we don't want to recharge. We want to be charging our main batteries. Okay, that's done. Sweet. Uh, obviously, we don't have anything connected here in the back at the moment because uh, we don't have those parts unlocked yet, which is lovely. Go ahead and color those. Um, okay. Okay. Hey, Billy, what's going on? Welcome, welcome, welcome. What did you miss? Not much. We're just redoing everything. Pretty much. Uh, I didn't remember I didn't save it last time. Uh, so we do redoing that. Uh, I also need to think about this bed because remember last time, guys, I got killed by this bed. Uh, so I'm going to be moving that. Uh, and my idea was to actually move it to to the top here. Now, another thing, since we're, we haven't been playing, is we got new windows. I don't know if we should be putting any new windows in this boat. Um, but I kind of think we should. Do we have them unlocked? Hold on. Okay, we don't have the portholes unlocked, but we have the 2x2 two two windows, the 2x3 windows. What else? 2 by 2 Okay, so we've got the windows. Do we need any new windows? Large window. Yeah. So they renamed it to large window. Okay. Don't think we actually need any of the new window pieces, to be fair. Yeah, we'll leave it like it is. Uh, I was going to put a ladder. So let's see. What we should do is... I want to move these chairs out of the way, first of all. Uh, let's get to get the chairs. Uh, what color? Gray. Yeah, let's go with gray. Get the chairs here. I know they're not under the cover, but that's fine. I don't really care if they're not under the cover. They can get wet. Uh, and then what I was thinking is doing a ladder system. So maybe just a simple, a simple ladder going up here on the side. Um, actually over here would be a good idea. Yeah, why not? Uh, I guess we could do it on the other side. Uh, let's grab the ladder piece. Okay, so we can only start the ladder from here, and it kind of needs to be. So that way we can get to the top of our ship. Let's fix this. And we can get to our bed, which we are going to be putting up here. So we 
can get up there if we need to, get down if we need to. Uh, the This is the fuel tank refuel area. Where is that? Oh, that's... What is that for? That's electricity. That's electricity. Okay, so those, that's to recharge everything. Our refueling is going to be over here. Okay, that's fair enough. And then our main fueling for our main fuel tank to sell fuel is going to be here in the front. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we could, I guess we could even put some more seats here in the front if we wanted to. Like here and here. That way we can put more people uh, if there ever there is a scenario where we need to carry a lot of people. What else? I think that's about it. Uh, I guess we could extend like this back area, but I'm pretty happy with it at the moment. Uh, I think everything else is connected. I'm just gonna go ahead and save this in. Um, is there anything else, guys, that we need to go ahead and add? Um, is there anything else that we need to do? Um, Bean Substance 500, great. Thanks, Max, appreciate that, man. Uh, Make a seat belt beep. Uh, but do we have logic for that? We don't have the, um, the beeper, unfortunately. Um, watch out for storms if you have the bed on the roof. Uh, yeah, but it's it, it's better to have it on. It's better to have it on the roof than where we had it before because where we had it before is we literally went to sleep, the wave went over us, and we died instantly. Um, so hence the reason why I've moved the bed now and I'm pl the plan is to have it on the roof. Uh, if I can find the bed, actually there is there. So what we'll do is, I don't know where, we'll put it, put it over there for now. Um, and then we can even change the color of it. Okay, there we go. <laughs> it's a random place to put a bed, but uh, I'd rather have it there than on the floor where we'll probably die if we have it so i think that's about it guys um might just do like a couple more detailing things but that's pretty much about it i think we can save it oops we can save it and get going with this uh and test it out why is that, that why does that look like a different color oh it's just the light uh okay we can pretty much save this and get it going and see how see how it works uh i think it's gonna be fine actually to be unfair um Just put that there like that just to make it look a little bit more decent we don't have any railings unlocked yet because so, i would love to put like some railings up here but we don't have them uh just yet so okay cool save done spawn this in and let's see let's see how it gets on uh window next to the ladder yeah i got the window when it's all done um yeah we can get up here as you can see and we can go to sleep which is cool. Uh, and then we can literally just jump down into the back area here. Let's just double check all our controls and things are working. Um, see our spotlights are working. Cool. Deck lights are good. Uh, cabin lights. Yes. And okay, we only have one now because we deleted the other one. That's fine. Uh, and then we have our gears. So two is reverse gear and six is high gear. That's fine. Let's go ahead and get some fuel in this guy uh, and see how it works. And if it does work. <laughs> so pump two hose and then we'll go ahead and just release that down. And then we just need to go and get it connected to that port there. That should be enough. Should be. Nope, that wasn't long enough. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. Um... Interior lights? We have interior lights, man. Okay, uh, that should be long enough now. Where is it? There it is there. Press E. Jump up. And let's get that connected. There we go. Nice and simple. Let's go check our fuel meter and see if that's working. Uh, okay, so fuel is going up very slowly because now we have a lot of fuel you know actually guys i'm just gonna uh disconnect this because i just want to test it before we go ahead and fill it up completely where we're going to go ahead and do a mission i just want to test to see if it actually is working um so throttle let's go ahead and hit that up turn it over 
There we go. Okay, that's very fast. And high gear? Even faster. Look at that, guys. Nice little starter boats. Oh, gears is nice and low. Temperature is nice and low. Fuel is probably going to last us a nice bit. Um, we can play around with our stabilization fins at the back. And we can probably even add some in the in the front of the ship just to, to get it to hunker down because you see here with this pro this problem is that it's going to be out of the water which we don't want because as soon as it gets out of the water it's going to start overheating so it's going to lower the throttle down here and come into ports but it's a fast ship it's a fast ship for, for this is a starter boat ship uh, with 5,000 basic cash. It's a bloody fast ship. Um, let's go ahead and just get it back in here and then what we're going to do is refuel it and then go ahead and start doing some missions. Cool. I don't think this guy is going to be too good on waves, but um, we'll test it out and see how it is and we can obviously make our alterations if we need to. Uh, let's just go ahead and refuel it. Cool. Uh, there we go. Uh, and that's going to go ahead and refuel. And do we have any missions currently available to us? Yeah, we have a medevac rig worker. So we'll go ahead and do that. Um, shouldn't be too far. No, it's not. It's just over here. Uh, cool. And we can buy crude oil while we're there too. Buy some crude oil. Get that done. Um... Make a hydrofoil? Eh, I don't think we don't have. We could make a hydrofoil as 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 it is right now. Um, let's try and think. Yeah, we could actually. To be fair, we could make a hydrofoil. Um, how do you get a fast boat? Uh, pretty much six engines, tons of gearboxes, um, and yeah, that's pretty much about it. Um, yeah, exactly. Yeah, Caleb, that's exactly, that's exactly how I do it. Um, it's exactly how I do it. Make a hydrofoil. Yeah, we'll, we'll go do a mission. We'll come back and we'll probably, we'll see, we'll, we'll see if we can try and make it into a hydrofoil. Um, but the thing is, I don't have any things to rails or anything. So it will have to be a, a hydrofoil all the time. Uh, I won't be able to make it. Wait, do we have altitude? We okay. We'll make it. We'll make it if we have an altitude sensor. If we don't have an altitude sensor, I can't make a hydrofoil. I'm not going to at least uh, risk it. What's up with this fuel? It's taking forever. I did have it connected, right? Didn't I? Yeah, connected in there. It's going into there. Oh man, it's, it's gonna take forever to fuel these tanks. Apparently, it's on thirteen percent. Um, we'll leave it for a bit. We'll, I just want to go go up there and check what's what's happening with those stats up there. Uh, oh wow, that is pumping super slow. That is super slow pumping. Um, Army of the CZ, hey, what's going on, man? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Jetka, first time on the stream. Cool, man. Don't forget the window. What window? Oh, there. Okay. Um, we'll fix that next time we come in. We'll fix that next time. Uh, yeah, this pump is slow, man. Um, Timothy, hey, what's going on, man? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Do connectors take forever? Yeah, man. Uh, Last stream they were fine. Now it's just terrible. <sighs> I don't think if we sleep, I don't think it's gonna make a difference either. To be fair. Um, okay, we're on nineteen percent of fuel. Um, <sighs> what can we do in the meantime? <laughs> just messing around now. Uh, is there lights in here? First off, shutter lights. Yeah. 
Hey, got some lights, shutter. Yeah. Cool. Nice little Vietnamese boat. Uh, you need a pump on the ship to fuel uh, in. Theoretically, I shouldn't. Uh, I shouldn't need a pump inside here if it's bringing fuel in. But I think, I don't know, we could try putting a pump in there when we unlock them. Uh, try and make it go faster. But in the meantime, I think we're pretty stuck. Um, yeah, we'll add a small boat. As soon as we unlock the pumps, we'll, we'll add them in. Um, also, what's the name? Guys, by the way, this is a brand new mic that I'm on today. Uh, so give me a thumbs up in chat if the if the quality is a little better than before. Um, or a thumbs down if you think it's worse than the than the, my, my quality of my YouTube videos or the last couple streams that we've been doing. Uh, but you let me know. Uh, is this going to be on the workshop? Yeah, at some stage we'll probably put it on the workshop, probably at the end of the survival series. Um, thumbs up. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, thanks, guys. Appreciate that. Uh, quality is so much better, mate. Thanks. Appreciate that. Uh... So what? More tanks in series, the slower it's going to be. Uh, okay. Oh, well. <laughs> Timothy, nice, nice emote, man. Uh, thanks, guys. Appreciate that. Smash that like button. Jacob, nice penguin. <laughs> Yeet. Uh, cool. Okay. Um, I think what we're going to do is let's sleep until it becomes daytime here. So, uh, tab, sleep, uh, and then we'll wake up. Oh, it's raining. Okay, that's fine. I can deal with rain. Uh, exit the bed. What are we on on our percentage at the moment? 30%. That's fine. We'll leave it like that. Uh, and then let's, let's go and do this mission. Get some money, 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 money. Okay. Uh, up the ladder, please. Here we need to hit it in reverse gear. Oh, actually, firstly, yeah, reverse gear. Electricity on. Reverse gear. Uh. Okay. Okay. Too fast. Too fast. Too fast. Okay, and then let's switch gears. Turn it over again. Go. And let's go get this sick sick worker. Uh, and let's get in high gear. Cool. Let me get the spotlights on, everyone. Uh, how's our battery? Battery's recharging. Cool. Get our spotlights on. Fantastic. We get our deck lights on also. Sweet. Nice one. Um uh, in the game by the Creative Island, uh what is the place with your name on it, Amazon New Jersey? Uh what do you mean the um the sunken ship ship or shipwreck, yeah. It is a sunken ship uh, with my name on it. Yes, indeed. Go check it out. It's got it's got some cool loot. Um, it's definitely worthwhile going and checking it out. Okay, let's go get this person. Get that. That. And that. Uh, we, I guess we could also start exploring for some some loot crates and things like that um, while we're here. Ooh. Uh, okay, we might buy some oil. Not now, but as soon as we find the, um, the place to sell the oil, I'm gonna come and buy oil. Because remember that, that ship, guys. You can actually we can actually sell. We can carry a lot of oil. Although it's, I'm guessing actually uh, it's probably gonna take forever to transfer it. Uh, you come with me, and that's my loot. Uh, Ooh, medium electric motor. Hmm, interesting. Um, let's have a quick look around, see if there's any more loot boxes. I don't think there is, but it's always worth a quick quick look. OK, 
Okay, let's go down. And put you into the boat. And then we should be able to just jump here. Jump here. Oh. Okay, you can go there. You are gonna go there. Uh, let's get this guy into reverse gear. To uh, what is my throttle? Change gears. Okay. Up we go. And let's transfer this person back. Um two minutes. Oh wow. Didn't even see that. Uh why do I take damage if I use a scuba suit to dive to uh you need a there's two things, there's scuba and there's diving equipment. Scuba is meant for uh, like very low depth, or not normal, normal like just normal scuba uh, at the surface, uh, so you don't get cold. Whereas the diving gear is meant to go beneath, um, I think like 20 or whatever it is, beneath 20. So just make sure you have the right gear, not scuba gear, actual proper diving gear. I'm hoping this is not going to damage my boat. There we go. Uh, let's go ahead and turn the power off. You come with me. And let's go. Oh, come on. I jumped fine. Frankly, I didn't. Let's try it again. Okay. 40 seconds. 15. Oh, no. Oh, no. 13. Oh, no. Oh, no. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm literally gonna throw him. Oh, look at that, guys. Look at that. Oh, man. That's what I call other skill or like, I'm not too sure. Um, <laughs> I'm not too sure what that was, but we managed to do it. Oh, another loot crate. Um, oh, another loot crate. Wow. That was, that was pretty good. Um, 10 out of 10. Yeah, that was that was good. Um, is there any more loot crates on this island? Let's go have a look. We already got two. Um, not too bad. Professional medic. <laughs> yeah. Uh, are there any loot crates here? Usually there are in the rocks, um, but I don't see any. I'm just going to mark our base. I'm going to go back to there and see if we have an altimeter. If we do, then we can make a hard refill. If we don't, we can't. Why are you waving at me? You're saved. Damn. Um. What do the electric uh, electric relays are for cutting the power using a toggle or on-off switch? So you can use an oh another crate there. Uh, you can use an on-off switch to cut power, pretty much. Large electrical battery. Meh, don't really need those at the moment. Um, there was a crate in the room. Really? On the desk? Let's go see. Let's go see. It's getting dark, guys. Oh, and I can't really get up here for some reason. Uh, I need my field to get up here. Yep. Is that why you're waving at me? Because there's there's crates in here. Okay, let's go look. Um, let's see. Crate on the desk. Where do, where, where where do you guys see a crate on the desk? I don't. A crate. There's no crates. Guys, we're lying to me. Lying to me. That's a phone. <laughs> Lol. Um. 
go ahead and get out of here. Want to turn my spotlights off? Seems that they're taking quite a lot of battery. Uh, yeah, let's get back to base. Now, the, the boat, the boat handles really well. Um, obviously, we'll have to see how it handles with with waves and so on and so forth. But I don't, I don't seem like we're, I don't think we're going to encounter waves just yet. Uh, we can always go to sleep if we get bad weather uh, at the end of the day. Yes, I have the air intakes on the roof, yeah. Fuel was only 20%, so we used, what, 7% of the fuel for that mission. Um, which is fine. I think what we should do is probably re carry on refueling. Um, actually, what I'm probably am going to do is, ooh, ooh, um, is extend that that uh, pipe or the cable out, drive this out, and see if we can get to our workbench. I'm just going to extend that cable all the way out now. This is Josie, I have a question. Yeah, Super Tesla, go for it, man. Uh, you can go, You're more than welcome to ask. Uh, all you guys can obviously help and chat, I can help, everyone can really much help. Uh, and then if not, always go over to the Discord and we're all, everyone's always on Discord, always willing to help out there, man. Um, okay, that should be enough cable. Um, well, obviously, I have to wait and see, of course. Should be more or less enough cable. Yeah, hydrofoil. That's exactly why I'm, I'm I'm bringing this out is because I want to refuel it at the same time while I'm checking to see if we can do a hydrofoil. I don't want to empty this and then have to have to refuel the whole vessel for us. I'm just gonna turn that on. Turn that on. It's gonna slowly reverse out of here. I'm worried at how long the pipe, the cable is, but it should be quite long. This cable is long, man. Okay, that's that's further enough, I think. Uh, let's go ahead and kill the engine. Yep. Turn the power off. Okay, so that's refueling at the moment, and it's not going to float away because we have that cable there, which is great. Um, 40 subs till 4k. Oh, that's awesome, man. Awesome, awesome, awesomeness. Nearly there, nearly there. Hopefully we'll get to 4k today, guys. Um, random user mail, hey, what's going, man? Welcome, welcome, welcome. What do you miss? Uh, not much. We're back. We start a new save. We've got our little Vietnamese fishing boat at the moment, and we're just going to go into the workbench and see um, if we have an altimeter or not. I don't think we do, to be honest, guys. Um, no, we don't. As soon as we get an altimeter, we'll do hydrofoils. But until then, I'm not. I'm not risking doing hydrofoils, to be honest. Um, electrical relay for those of you guys who were asking about earlier is, um, as I said, it pretty much brings the flow from one point to the other point, but you can stop the state or you can stop the electricity by using an on-off switch. Uh, so it opens or closes it. Pretty cool. Quite useful for, um, well, could you use it for when you when you want to cut the electricity to a certain component uh, using like a push toggle button if you wanted to do that for some reason, um, or if you want to stop the electricity from a system. So for example, if, you, if you're in a helicopter and... I don't know if you're in a helicopter and your main power cuts, uh, for example, and you lose power to your whole vehicle, uh, you can then have that when the power turns off 
or loses, turns everything off, you could then have that switch uh, turn your, your relay on to get your emergency battery connected. Uh, so it's like, you can do pretty cool automation things with it. Uh, but yeah, you can play around and say, uh, I'm sad I don't have the portals unlocked as a start, but uh, it's what it is. Um, so let's see how full we are. Our oh, ship is around 2000. So, uh, it's going to carry on going. Um, yeah, you pay what's going on. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, do I stream on Twitch? Uh, no, I don't. I keep it on YouTube. Up for YouTube, and obviously, all you guys are here on YouTube, so that's why I keep it on YouTube. Um, it's an easy, easy system, to be honest. Okay, so I think we're gonna go back on our boat here and have a little sleep. Uh, can I? Oh, hello. Don't know how I just did that, but apparently, I'm Superman. Let's just climb up here uh, and then let's climb up here and let's sleep until we get another mission hopefully I don't die um, are we gonna get another mission we did okay retrieve all rig parts uh, I think we can do that uh, let's exit the bed uh, our vehicle should be pretty much fueled up now let's see 40 50 percent nearly uh, that's fine let's go and disconnect that cool Going to here, uh, let's get our lights on. Get a reverse going. Okay, and then where do we need to go for this mission? Okay, so, oh, hold on, what is this? We can sell diesel. Okay, we don't want to sell diesel because we have to make it first. Um, we can buy crude, that's fine. Okay, we need to get the oil rig part, which is over there. Okay, let's go do that then. Um. Come on, turn over. There we go. Cool. Let's go over to our next place. Hey, Mr. Jersey, can you please uh, do an app version of the jet engine tutorial? Um, also do a generator special because the pit doesn't work for me right now. I have got a um, tutorial coming very, very soon, probably this week, uh, for the an updated version of the jet engine because a couple of things have changed and I do understand that. Uh, and I know a lot of you guys have been asking for it, so it will be coming this week. Um, coming. So yeah, look out for that. Uh, have you seen the Mythbusters and Stormworker? Uh, what do you mean? What do you mean, man? Oh, F34 Gamut, yeah, it was probably an old, very, very old channel um, that I used to have years ago, didn't really use. What is this that we are busy grabbing? Ooh, can we even take that? This is going to be interesting. I don't know if we could actually even take that on our ship. Turn that off. Oh, we don't. We just need to put it up there. Ah, okay. I forgot about that. Um, okay, we'll leave the ship there. We just need to put it up on top of the on top of the thing. That's easy enough. And this girl now made a Mrs. Uh, video. Uh, if you have any suggestions, you can tell me. Okay, cool. Uh, what's the name? Drop me a link in Discord and I'll go check it out. Uh, let's go left and... Ooh, that's quick. Uh, and let's go down. I think there's actually buttons in there to go move it down. <gasps> no! Uh... Oh, well. Let's go back and try again. I have a time limit? Yeah, I do, but it's not bad. It's hour and 20. Mm. Yeah, I'm just going to bring it down from here. Uh, much easier. Um, okay, 39 subs, still 4k. Thank you, Jacob. 35? Um, 
what it should be updating in uh it should be updating live for us here on the stream on my side it says uh three three nine five five what are the buttons in the in lift then is that deep enough yeah it is um what are the buttons inside here then oh they do look up and down there they are Social Blade says a 3961. Uh, okay. Okay, can I, where is the handles? There we are. Oh wow. This thing is quite light. Am I tracking subs uh, through YouTube? Yeah. Uh, I'm using it through, so at Orma he does it through OBS, which is pretty cool. Um, makes my life easier. Bring this guy up. There we go. Yeah, okay. bring this up. Yeah, now the problem is that I'm now facing the other way. How am I gonna get there? Can I, bring, I wonder how far I could bring this up. Yeah, that's one thing is going to try to jump back in there. But um, this is going to be... There we go. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. Jesus, that turns quickly. Uh... Where do you want this? I feel like I'm Superman. I can carry that. What have we got? We got a nuclear inverter, large locomotive, and... Oh, uh, boring stuff. Boring things. Um, okay, let's go to our boat. Have a sleep. I uh, should be able to jump here without dying, hopefully. Yep. Uh, let's have a little sleep. Until we get another mission, let's carry on going. Um, okay. Everything's off. Cool. Yeah. Uh, oh, no. Do that. Tab. Sleep. Oh, here comes the waves. Transfer fisher fisher person. Okay, let's sleep. Wake up. Cool. Okay, we got a little bit of waves. Uh, I think we'll be fine, to be honest. Uh, let's exit. Let's get that on our radar. Where do we need to go? Five k's that direction and two k's in that direction. Okay, fair enough. That's easy enough to do. Uh, back into our boat. Power on. Let's get our throttle up. Okay. Feels still good, I think. And let's go and get this person. It's actually in that direction, great. <laughs> cool. Um, we might play around with our stabilization thing at the back. That's pushing us down at the moment. Yeah, we want to try and stay in the water as much as possible because of our um, our engines are going to overheat if they get out the water that much. Seems to be okay at the moment. Seems to be okay. We'll see what we're doing. Um, yeah, these are the first waves the boats have seen. Um, at the moment, the stabilization is at the back. It's just digging it straight into the water. Um, where is this fisher person? Are they actually on the island? They are. Okay. just making us dig into the water um just helping us quite a bit could probably slow down here there 
That should be perfect. Turn the power off, uh, and let's go get this person. At the same time, I saw a crate up on that hill, so we'll go and try and find that crate. Um, there it is there. Cool. Oh, electric motors. I don't need any more electric motors. I have enough of them. I need an altimeter so we can go ahead and actually do some cool things. Any crates in here? No. How about in here? No. Here? No. Here? No. Here? No. In the church, maybe? Let's see if there's any, any loot boxes in here. I doubt it will be, but... Nope. Okay, where's the person? There he is. Let's get him on the boat and let's get out of here. Um... Hey, say what's going on? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Yeah, you come with me. Jump on our boat. You can go right in there. And let's get out of here. Let's get reverse going. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, that's the problem with stabilization. <laughs> Make sure you've got it reset. There we go. Um. And then let's go drop these people off. Waves have seemed to have gone down a bit, so we're back in business here. Um, still want to hunker down in the water, though. Yeah, I think that's good. It seems to be handling pretty well. Um, does lean to one side though which is pretty weird but but it works well could do something like that but then the problem is the engines are going to overheat like super quickly because it's out of the water Ideally, what we need is we need to put some um, fin runners in the front of the ship to dig that dig that in also, or or just put just put um, uh, put some things on it, uh, some thing majiggies, <laughs> some hydropoles on this. But uh, we need to first of all unlock the altitude sensor to do that. Bye, Jeff. You're there. Okay, we still haven't found the place where can we sell ah here we go so we can sell crude oil back okay so the next thing we're going to be doing guys is going to be doing a mission where we go and buy crude and sell it there and buy diesel back there we go we're going to start making some money guys we're going to start making some big money now Uh, which type of stabilization? I'm just using fin rudders at the back where it's just literally digging, digging the boat into the water or digging it out of the water. Uh, it's a very simple way of doing it. I'm just using my up and down from the control seat to use. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much about it. Waves are going to are starting to get a little bigger, so we'll see how the boat handles. We'll dig it down. 
So you see now I've got, a, I've got the Fenrader to the back. Okay, that wasn't a good idea. Um, I had them fully face down, that's why they weren't going like that. We'll get them pushed up a bit. And get restarted here. So this boat doesn't like to be on waves, but it can handle them. I can see here it's, it's pretty much just digging into the water. Um, it's making us a little bit wet inside, but it's okay. Ooh, okay, we're actually at the mission already. Uh, go ahead and throw down here. that and let's go get this person and get them on board uh -oh. find a way how to get onto their ship their ship is bouncing around the place man ah. there we go have your person uh what do we get we got a winch landing float and a small wheel i uh, still not what we really want um but Doable. What's in there? I don't want to go in there just in case I can't get out. Uh, I want to get back on my boat though. Oh, I don't want to get out of here. Okay, um, let's see. Turn that, turn that. I'm going to go try and go right over them. Yep, there we go. That's how we do it. Uh oh. Come on, turn. And I want to go home now. I want to get out of these waves. I just have to lower the throttle down a bit here, guys. Got 4k to go. Wow. Okay, that's fine. We've got 4k to go. Okay. Balance is off due to the ladder. Yeah. Might have to add a couple of weight blocks here and there. Um, otherwise, we'll, what we could do is build another feature on the other side. <laughs> I left them to sink by opening the hatch. I think it was a push. I think it was a push button. Uh, I don't think it was a toggle button, so I don't think they'll be sinking, to be honest. Um, uh, I use Streamlabs OBS, yeah. I use the Streamlabs version. So it's got everything built into it, which is pretty cool. Uh, I used to, back in the day, I used to use this regular, regular OBS. Uh, but then I found the Streamlabs, I was like, ooh, this does everything. Awesome. I haven't seen any crates in the ocean yet, um, which is quite unusual. Usually they're, they're all around everywhere, but um, not today. I think we could probably, I don't know how much, okay, we got 20,000. Do we have enough money to buy an island, a new island? I uh, want, I would like to buy that island. That's a bigger, bigger base building area, which will be good. Actually, I don't even know why we're going home. Um, I guess we could go back to refuel. Uh, we don't really need to refuel. Um, yeah, but I think, okay, we'll go back to base, we'll sleep, and then we'll, we'll head off and buy some fuel and try and salt. Um, the hatch is 4x4 four four for hold for storing fish. Oh, okay, okay. Um, when am I going to build different boats? Uh, I think what we'll do is we'll run the fuel mission and then we'll probably go and buy that island and we'll start building a new boat. I think that'll be a good idea. Half my engines aren't working. Yeah, probably not. Or it could just be because they're at a low RPS. Um, now they're all still turning if you have a look at the, um, at the props. But I think it's just because we're at such a low RPS. You see, if I go ahead and boost the RPS up, you can see now we get exhaust coming through both of them. 
but um, yeah, nice, nice, stable little, little boat. What did you uh, flood the intakes for a few seconds? I did, yeah, at some stage, but I think it's fine. Adrian, hey, what's going, man? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, let's scroll it down here and bring it into ports. Uh, and then we're gonna sleep. And we'll go and do some fuel missions. Bring it in there. Fantastic. Turn that off. Get out and let's sleep on this side of the boat. <gasps> ah, damn it. Okay, tab, sleep. Cool. Oh, that weather is terrible. I'm going to sleep through that. Much better weather. Okay, let's go do some fuel, quick fuel missions, guys. Uh, let's get the throttle back up. Get the electricities on. And we are going to go and buy the crude oil over here. There we go. So you can see the use of the stabilization fin, you can literally make it go down or up as you want in the water. At the moment, I'm just going to lift it up like that. I think it's pretty fine. That way we're getting, a, we're probably getting a good speed. I don't know what speed we're at, to be honest. Um, but yeah, our fuel, we are using quite a bit of fuel. Okay, let's kill the throttle. Uh, and where is the fueling area? Over there. Okay. And then we're going to stop underneath that area there and we are going to refuel this guy. I think that's probably too far. Great, I'll have to go into reverse. And that was too quick. should be fine turn that off uh let's go up and let's fill up our front hatch here stop boat boat please stop oh. honestly i can't get that right um okay power on Battery sounds terrible. That's fine. That's why we have our emergency battery. Can always refill it. Those pumps have 100 meters of hoses. Yeah, I think they're fine. Uh, guys, calm down in the, in the chat. Be friendly. No reason to be upset. Okay, so let's go ahead and we're going to bring it down first off. So hose out. Then we also can bring it to the left a bit. go bring it all the way down and then we're gonna pump two hose actually yeah pump two hose and we're gonna pump here yeah. okay what's the cable length like now is it reached all the way down okay i can't see hold on is it on the boats 
No, I don't think so. Let's do third person here. Hold on. It's close. Okay, we'll get a little bit longer so we can just bring it, drag it across there. Not by much though. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, that should be fine. And we'll jump down. And let's go and grab that. Uh, let's go onto my boats. Let's see if we can get to the front of the boat here without causing too many issues. Okay, and connect. Hello? Connect. There we go. Okay, so we're going to buy all that crude oil that's inside there, fill up our tanks as much as we can, and then we'll go sell it and see see how much money we get for that. Um, as you guys can see how much money I'm spending. I have about, what, 20,000 plus minus now. So um, we'll see how much we end up spending at the end of the day. Also need to keep an eye on our fuel. We only have 50%. Don't know how long that's, if that's going to be. It should get us there. It should be able to get us there. I also probably should have a gauge on that to know how much fuel's in there, but we don't have. Um... That's fun. Hey, Miss Bubble, what's going on, man? Um, yeah, it's it glitches out like that. That's when I pressed E once. If I hold down E, it, it seemed to have wor it worked a little better. Um... Um, ba -ba -ba. Okay, cool. So we stop doing that. We can disconnect this now. Go away. Uh, and we can carry on. Let's see. Hold on. Press hold E. Still glitched out. Okay. Oh, well. It's glitched out. Uh, now you can see we're quite heavy in the front of the ship with all that fuel in it. So we'll see how that affects us, actually. Could, could be quite bad for us, but we'll see. Can we get it started with the battery so low? No, we need our emergency power. Come on. Okay, hold on. Uh, no, no, take that off. Battery's on 30% on both. Uh, throttle's on full, that's fine. Gear. When it starts, turn that off. Nope, this guy is dead. I don't know why it doesn't want to start. Oh, man. Man, oh man, oh man. It should start. Uh, I don't know why it didn't want to. And we don't have enough battery now to get this guy started up again. Um, turn that on. I don't think that's enough battery, to be fair. Um, Battery's too low to get it started. Fantastic. That is the first trash of the season, guys. That air intake's up here. That is the first trash of the season. We need to um, get back to base and get another vehicle. Um, now, I can't fast travel at all. Which kind of sucks because that means I have to swim there. 
um, from all the way there, which is not going to be fun. Two k's of swimming. If I don't get eaten by a shark on the way, uh, which I don't think we will, but you never know. <laughs> What's that small ocean trash? Yes, it is indeed. It is indeed. Unfortunately. Uh, this is probably going to take quite a bit of time, guys. Um, which kind of sucks. Yeah, I know. Uh, you know, I used the emergency battery, but that still didn't help. Um, still didn't help us. Uh, if you die, you'll respawn. Yeah, I could do that. Okay, cool. We'll die and we'll respawn at base. Um, this is because I don't want to really die because we have permadeath. We didn't. Oh, sorry, we don't have permadeath. I guess we could just do this. Uh, it's an easier way of doing it. Uh, it's kind of boring swimming two Ks. Um, so I guess that's fine at the end of the day. Didn't want to die, but eh, it is what it is. <laughs> just casually drowning. Yeah, exactly. Um, okay, we'll get another boat up and we'll go and recharge that guy. Okay, so let's grab our boats. I think everything's good in here at the moment. But what I want to do is I want to get back bigger batteries in here because that was an issue. Uh, it's not having big enough batteries, so probably put them in the back because we've got enough waste in the front so we'll put those guys there they shouldn't be too heavy um how much do they weigh they weigh 60 okay yeah let's just leave two we'll get two of those and those will be our, our way to recharge recharge we also need to add electrical cables um so let's just go ahead and grab those electrical cables and put those on And then, what do we have? One of them is going to be for electricity, which is that one. And then the other one is going to be a normal small connector. Cool. Got that done. Let's go ahead and just get the power connected. So that is going to get connected to there and there. And then that's going to get connected there, 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 there and there. And then we just need the data. So this is in. That's uh, just out. Oh, cool. This one is in. That's the magnet for the toggle. And cool. That's all done. All's fixed there. Uh, what are the changes we need to make to the ship? I don't think we needed to make anything else. Um. You need a clutch on the boat for startup. Uh, yeah, but it kind of works with that one, to be fair. Um, need a way to tow. Yeah, well, the thing is, we have a connector here in the front. Um, once we recharge it, because we have we have ports on the ship for recharging over here. Um, so what we'll do is we'll recharge it and then we'll tow it or we'll connect it from that to the front of the other ship and tow it back into base. Uh, we'll fill this up with fuel, get it going. I'm just going to go ahead and save this guy because now we have tons of battery life on it. Uh, we can go ahead and spawn this guy in and we'll have to refuel it. The boat digs in quite a bit to the water, but that's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and get this hose in. Uh, do I need a release for the electric connector? No, you just press E on it. Uh, it's same like the fuel connector. Nah, we're gonna stay away from clutches. To be fair, uh, they take up space, and uh, I just don't, I don't like them. To be fair, um, yeah, but gears should be fine. Um, gears should be more than fine. I don't know why it didn't start um, start up. To be fair, but. We should have more than enough battery now to get it going and working again. Is 20 a high PR RPS? Uh, yeah, it's quite a high RPS. As you guys see, I usually run my ships on about 5, 4 RPS as a standard. That way it uses much less fuel. Um, but it's up to you. You have to kind of play around with it until you get it right. 
That should be enough. Down there. Up. There we go. And then let's wait for this to refuel. Yeah, that's going much faster than it was going before, guys. No? Maybe I'm wrong, but I, I don't know. That feels like it's going a little faster than what it was going before. Um, too much weight, no clutch. Yeah, that could be the issue, to be fair. Um, how do you turn the flash style on? Uh, just press V. Yeah, yeah, as everyone's saying, just press V. Um... Yeah, that could exactly be the issue is that there's there's too much weight and there's and and the issue obviously but that's fine what we'll do is we'll go and grab our other boat um recharge it and get it working uh bring it back to base get it all sorted and we'll probably transfer the fuel across or something something to that extent but um we will sort it out at the end Okay, let's go in and see how much fuel we actually have percentage-wise. Uh, we have 40%, which should be more than enough to get there. So let's do, let's cut it off. Uh, turn it off there. Yeah, get this disconnected. Cool. Start it up. Uh, I might just sleep until it becomes daytime here. Oh, that's not whether to do for cover reason. That's better. And we've got a whole bunch of missions that we also need to take care of, uh, but that's fine. What we'll do is we'll get our boat back first. Let's get up the throttle, uh, power on. There we go. Where is that boat, by the way? Uh, over here somewhere. Okay, let's get that going. Um, <laughs> no survival series would be complete without ocean waste. Yeah, that's true. That is true. Uh, towing other ships that's full of fuel uh, is going to be fun. Yeah, it will be fun. Um, <laughs> it's going to be interesting, but uh, I think we'll be. I think we can manage it. To be fair. Where is the, th the question is where is the boat that is there is there we'll go ahead and get it connected up and see if we can get it moving uh, oh yeah we also need to get it re recharged get some electric in it okay let's start slowing down a bit Okay, that should be fine where we are right here. Turn the electricity off. And then let's get these cables out. Why is that not working? Um, I'm sure I gave power to all this. Ah, uh, because I turned the electricity off here. That's why. Stupid me. Um, so... Come on. So glitchy. Okay, let's climb up here. We need to go over here. Okay, and I, there we go. So then that should be in theory. Oh, hey, look, battery's recharged. To recharging both those batteries now cool uh we could actually disconnect that turn that off turn that off disconnect that guy get him back into our boats uh in cool and then we need to get the front connector done so let's get that him out him on 
And let's go over here, turn this guy on. Can we? Oh no, we need the power on to do that. Uh, and power that on. And then let's get our boats just a little bit forward. Uh, power is on, throttles up. Let's get it up there. That should be fine. And then we should be able to just grab that. Some over here. Get that connected. Come on. There we go. And let's stop the that's Okay, let's climb up. Um and let's see how this how this actually is going to work, if it's going to work, if anything. So uh let's get the throttle up. I was on. Cool. Hey, look at that. That's not bad. <laughs> uh, oh, well, how's our battery, by the way? That's fine. Okay, let's go deliver this fuel. Let's get some money for it. I'm not going to waste the time. Um, all that time and effort just to have not gotten any money out of us. So we're gonna go deliver this, get our money for it, and then bring it back to base. Um, your boat will bug? Ah, oh, it's fine. It's fine in the day. It's fine. I'm nine away from 4K, really? Is my, is my um, stream not updating, guys? I thought it was. Hey, Boxy Games, what's going on, man? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, so, um, in the corners, the, there's a live sub gun. Yeah, I know. And that's, if I'm correct, that still says 3955. Um,. And then on my side, I can see it's nine, it's three, nine, six, two. So I don't know actually, to be fair. Okay, the boat seems to be handling in the back quite well. What I think we should probably do is make like a fuel barge of some sort um, for the ship. Because then a fuel barge you can just pretty much disconnect and disconnect whenever you want. <laughs> Everyone's fighting over it in, in chat. I love it. I love it. Um, yeah, that could be a good idea, Samuel, uh, to make a small tug. Definitely could be a good idea. Mr. Grab, say what's going on, man? Uh, we are just towing our ocean waste that has a lot of fuel in it over to the uh, island here to sell, uh, to sell all the fuel. Uh, to Why am I losing money? Why did I just lose money? Oh well, that's weird. Come on, turn. Don't know why I just lost money. Um, <laughs> everyone getting your ult and sub now. <laughs> no, you don't have to do that, guy. You don't have to do that. Um, ocean waste is getting closer. I can smell it. Um, 
Okay, let's turn here and see if we can get it into the dock area without killing the engines. Feels still good. Are we gonna fit underneath? I think we will. Yay, we will. The jets. Diesel. Diesel I need for this one. Uh oh. Slow down. Okay, cool. So, let's turn the power off on all these. We don't need them on. Although that's just gone ahead and disconnected our batteries, so... Maybe I should leave the power on. Uh... Yeah, we'll leave the power on. Actually, no. Let's disconnect the power. Uh, I'm not gonna take- I'm not gonna take the risk of not having electricity at some stage. Um, so let's turn the power off on this guy. I'm gonna do the same on the other guy. Uh, oops. Turn you off. And then let's get up onto the dock and transfer some fuel and make some money. Uh, got that kid say what's going on. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, it's in zero percent fuel. Which one? Well, that one's full of crude oil. That one's got a little bit of diesel in it. So I'm going to firstly um, buy... Well, actually, I'm going to sell the one that I have. So let's get this it ties out. So I'm going to sell all the crude oil back to the base and get some money for that. And then I'm going to probably sell the diesel that I have in there also. And then I'm going to buy diesel and put it into my new ship that I'm towing with. Why is this so glitchy? There we go. Uh, am I going to break it? I am. There we go. Come on. So close. Come on. There we go. So I'm making money now. Awesome. 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 Let's get diesel out of there too at the same time. I wonder how much money I'll get from that. I don't know. It, 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 could be, it could be quite interesting to see. That was a full tank of crude, so as I said, it'll be quite interesting to see how much I actually get out of that. Um, can I sell diesel to them? I don't think I can, can I? No, I can only buy it. Damn it. I will. Okay, so I'll put the diesel in my new, in my new vessel. Uh, let's get the hose out in the meantime. Turning, we wanted to get it to about there. Cool. And hose out. About there will be fine. Uh, and let's get that guy connected to there. Might need to go a little no go. Cool. So then that's filling up with diesel. Um that is making me money with crude. I think I'll probably put diesel in there afterwards. Uh I'm not too sure yet be fair um i might just take it back to base and get rid of it but we'll see can you raise the bridge uh this bridge yeah i can i guess we could do that now while we're waiting for this to actually you know i'm gonna sleep just become daytime and then we'll, we'll raise that bridge and hopefully by then um we should be selling and doing things We also need to do these missions because at the moment I'm busy failing all of them. So I'm still making money, which is good. Um, actually, before we do that, oh, can I get on? No, I want to come down. Can I come back down? Uh, I want to go up there and see if I can find any crates. Um, uh, enable that and jump on. And then while that's selling and making me money, 
Okay, it's stopped making me money now. It's I'm only spending money, which is fine because I'm buying that diesel. So I didn't get that much money for that crude that I had, to be fair. I don't know if there actually are any crates here. I haven't really spent much time here before. I'll have a quick look and see if there's any crates. No, it doesn't look like there's any crates here. Oh well. Um, yeah, let's go back down to the boats. Get out of here. Be able to jump without hurting myself. Yeah. Nice little gate. Okay, let's go down. I didn't see any crates there, are there? No, they're not. Yeah. <laughs> Got weight, bro? <laughs> Low. Got enough weight blocks? Yeah. Okay, um, okay, so that's been completely we drained this guy. Cool. Um, this guy is, should have a full full tank, more or less. No, he's only on 50%. So slow. Oh. I think we need a pump, but as soon as we unlock pump, we'll get a pump in there. I'm just going to double check here. What is, what's going on here? Uh, fuel's still low. That's fine. The battery's good. Cool. Yeah, let's get this guy disconnected. Cool. And we need to get this and that connected again. But I think what we should do first is get the boats turned around. Which I think we could probably just push them. Which would be fair enough. Oh, it's large enough to be pushed. It should be at least. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Push, 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 push. We just need to push the back end. And then what we'll do is we'll get it connected to that boat and we can take off from here. Okay, for some reason it doesn't like that. So, ah, it's because of the cable. That's why I wouldn't let me do it. Let's try again. Still doesn't like it. Hmm. Okay, let's try this. Um, let's get the throttle up. Get the power on. What? No, 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 I'm not selling crude. Stop it. Stop it! Get off. Go away. Okay, let's get back on here. Uh, throttle. go and let's get it cool now let's get this guy connected to that but first we need to get power on that guy done then where is my okay up we go go uh. What was that? Really? Really? The hell? The hell? Okay, well, it looks like this boat is actually going to be trying this boat now. Um. What? Re. Re 
Hurry. Yeah, that's a pity. Um, <laughs> oh well, I guess we, I'm glad I recharged this guy. Um, this is gonna be interesting. Actually, what are you doing? Okay, hold on. <laughs> oh no. We are, I don't know how we're gonna be dragging that guy back, but it's gonna be quite interesting to see how we're gonna get, be able to do that. Um, I'm gonna get the emergency power on now. Okay, let's throttle up, turn it. Oh, that thing's like a brick. I'm just gonna run the engines for a bit. Um, just to actually recharge the battery a little bit. Um, yeah, ocean trash, ocean trash, ocean trash. Uh oh. Okay. No, 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 no. What? Oh no, now I'm underwater. Um. Um. Yeah. So that's a. That's a thing. Um. Uh oh. Yeah, exactly. I wonder if we could... I'm sure there's a way to do this. Uh, hold on. There. Two. Really? Oh, I'm just gonna die here, ain't I? Yep, I'm gonna die there. Oh, great. Oh no. Yeah, leave them there for future recovery. Exactly what I've done. Exactly what I've done, guys. Exactly what I did. <laughs> Again, I'm gonna save here and let's do. Cool. Okay. Let's confirm that. Save that in there. Yeah, I know. Epic fail. I know. I know. It kind of sucks, but it is what it is at the end of the day. Um, we will definitely... How much money do we have? See, now we have no money because we spent all our money on those two boats and buying fuel and stuff that we don't have any more money. Well, we have enough. We have enough to buy another boat. Um, we'll have to get some missions done and things like that and start getting some more money in before we can actually do those recoveries uh, at the end of the day. Next mission, build a crane and uh, towing truck uh, boat. <laughs> yeah, Jacob. Uh, listen, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the stream there for today. Uh, I know it's a little bit of a shorter one than we usually do, um, but i got some things to get done for tonight. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed the stream as always and found out somewhat entertaining and, and fun. I <laughs> know, oh, I've had fun. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much about it. Yeah, sorry, guys. I know, don't be upset uh, with me too much. Um, but as always, if you guys haven't already subscribed, don't forget to hit that sub button. Uh, hopefully we'll hit 4k today sometime, um, but we'll see what happens with that. Uh, but thanks very much everyone for coming in, stopping by and watching today's stream. As always, uh, come back next weekend. Uh, we'll pick it off where we left off and we'll see what we crack on with that. 
Uh, and yeah, and then w look out for the stream, uh, the videos during the week, uh, as always, um, with the top five, and we'll get the new build series, and also one of the tutorials coming up in the next week. Uh, so yeah, look out for that. Uh, and yeah, thanks very much. Thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.